time now to focus on our students for a few minutes. Please welcome to the stage Reed Taylor for the undergraduate update, followed by Micho for the graduate update. Well, good morning slash almost afternoon to everybody. I realize I'm one of the last people standing to give you a lunch, so we'll try to keep this brief. Um, as she introduced me, my name is Bree Taylor. I'm currently the president of the Aggie X Club. For those of you that haven't heard of that, Aggie X is our club for the Agricultural Economics Department. So basically, we have a lot of different ag business and ag economic students, but we also have a lot of, or not a lot, but some animal science and ag communication students as well um, that like to come in and listen to the different speakers that we have come in. Um, what we focus on, we really focus on a lot of career opportunities, networking, and just professional development for a lot of the students that are in our club. Um, what a normal meeting looks like for us. We have different speakers come in that are in the, in the industry, and we have them talk about how their involvement in ag business degree um, help them get to where they are and the steps they took to get there. Just to give you some recent updates, we had our uh, new officer elections in last March. Um, as I said, I'm the president. We have two vice presidents, Kathy LaPointe and Ross Brighton. Um, our secretary or communications uh, manager is Sydney Vieira. Our treasurer is Matthew Hansen, and our student council rep is Nathan Deflon. Um, we had a meeting at the end of last year kind of talking about what we projected and what we wanted to see for this next year. Um, and we were all really hopeful that things were going to get back to a sort of normal with still some of the COVID regulations and things like that coming into play. And that's kind of what we're seeing this year as well. Um, we have a lot of things that we're getting back to what we would do in a normal year. So that's really exciting. Um, at the end of August, we got to have our back to school bash, which what we do at this is we have, um, we invite all of our new and old super members come to Boomer Lake. And we have kind of a cookout. We cook hot dogs and hamburgers and have different faculty come out and have them talk about what they do within the department and also just continue to allow those students to network with the faculty and also just expose them to the new things that they can do within Aggie X and also and that they can do with the faculty in our department. Um, just last week we had our first normal meeting uh, as our regular October meeting. What we talked about, we talked about some of our different things coming up like homecoming, our banquet committee, um, and also our community service project for the fall which is called Into the Streets. So November 6th, we will be going out, uh, participating in Into the Streets, which is uh, an event where students will go to a certain member of the community's house that has requested help with cleaning up their yard, painting their fence or things like that. And so that's our community service project that we're gonna be participating in. Um, also something that we would like all of you guys to know about is November 13th, which is the TCU game. Um, we are going to be having a tailgate for hosted by Aggie X and everyone's invited. We'd like to invite different faculty um, alumni, students, so everyone can continue to network and just continue to get to know everyone. Um, that's just kind of my updates and uh, new information from Aggie X and the undergrad program. So thank you all for listening and have a great day. Hi, y'all. I'm Pete Cho. Um, He's a PhD candidate in agriculture and economics department at Oklahoma State University. Uh, as you expected, I'm a president of Aggie Crown Graduate Student Association. Um, first of all, uh, I'm so honored to um, stand here and say about my uh, favorite group in my life. Honestly, like, uh, I got uh, my bachelor's and master's degrees from Oklahoma State, so my GSA is my whole life. So. I love this group. Um, it, it will not surprise anybody that 2020 had, um, had been a really difficult time for all people. Um, so there were so many restrictions on getting together. So we couldn't have any um, usual meetings in all 2020. However, we tried um, to keep connecting together and um, did our best in our own respective places. So we, um, we had a three virtual meetings with uh, three alumni who are currently working in a private industry and academic. Uh, we invited them and they shared a really good job seminar for our graduate students. So I believe our graduate students really satisfied it. So in 2020 to 2021 academic year, um, our three PhD and seven master students were graduated 
believe it or not, our job seminar might work. So they found all the places what they want. Uh, this year, um, 19 new incoming students uh, coming as a new student. So currently we have a 51 total uh, graduate students, 25 for PhD and 19 for MS and 7 for Master of Tech students. Um, thankfully, this semester we resumed our traditions uh, like welcome back social at Eskimo Joe beginning of the semester and then annual uh, and monthly regular meetings and Google pickups. So we already had two um, September and October monthly meetings. We invited our new um, persistent professors. One of them is a Dr. Emerson, and then other persons, I can say him, but Dr. Schaefer's gave us a new, so they came to our um, seminar, uh, our meeting, and they shared their life lessons, what they learned during their graduate college time. Um, so we will invite a librarian in November meeting, so he will get, give a seminar how to use um, library data resources for our own uh, research. Um, next semester, we will um, keep um, inviting the guest speakers. Um, so, if anyone interested in to meet our um, smart people and then um, you share your um, thoughts or advice for our graduate students, welcome to join our um, meeting as a guest speaker. And we will have um, if COVID restriction, COVID 19 protocol allow, we will have an international dinner meeting um, in next next March. So we will keep trying to our best and then we will keep on connecting each other. So appreciate again to report um, our GSA uh, group here and then go focus. Thank you.